Former First Lady Lee Hee-ho, the widow of late President Kim Dae-jung, will visit North Korea during the first week of next month. Her visit is largely aimed at providing much-needed help to North Korean children, but some are hoping it will contribute to easing strained inter-Korean relations. Our Han da eun has this report. South Korean delegates from a peace center established by late President Kim Dae-jung met with their North Korean counterparts on Monday to discuss the much-anticipated visit of former First Lady Lee Hee-ho's visit to the North. After the meeting held in north-south border town of Kaesong, South Korean Chief Delegate Kim Sung jae said that Lee will fly to Pyongyang on August 5th for her four-day trip, which will be mainly focused on providing aid to North Korean children. She's expected to visit children's hospitals and daycare centers in the reclusive state's capital. Whether she'll meet North Korean leader Kim Jong-un remains unknown. But pundits say the chances of their encounter are high, as Kim views late President Kim Dae-jung, who played a leading role in realizing the first-ever inter-Korean summit in 2000, in a favorable light. Hopes are high that her visit could contribute to thawing the icy relations between Seoul and Pyongyang. The South Korean government has not relayed any kind of message to Yi, but stated that it fully supports her visit. Some also hope that Yi will secure the release of four South Koreans currently detained in the North, but experts argue that would be beyond expectations, as freeing detainees requires extensive diplomatic efforts. Han Dan, Arirang News.